Welcome back, foul mouth fishing. All my hookaholics. So it's set up. So uh, this is going to be another kind of cool video. Um, I just thought I'd drop in and uh, do a little uh, reveal of what's soon to be the little foul mouth fishing test tank. So I figure when I do my unboxings, I can actually go straight from the box. And if I have something like a little jig head and a little, uh, you know, jig head trailer or uh, drop shot hook and drop shot bait, stuff like that. I can actually throw them right here into this little 30 gallon test tank and give them a, a little, uh, you know, visual cue as to how they're going to react, how the claws are going to float, flutter, how it swims in the water. I mean, it's certainly not a pool, so I can't do, you know, long moving baits, jerk baits, stuff like that, crank baits. But little st tiny stuff, um, little floating baits, you can actually get a somewhat of a decent idea of what that will look like uh, brand to brand. But I just wanted to drop in, show, show that little, uh, little snippet. And, uh, as the thumbnail will uh, obviously attest, or I should say the thumbnail is going to be down there, <laughs> um, this is going to be another giveaway. So this is a rewind giveaway, basically. Um, as everybody knows, I do the, uh, the, uh, the uh, MTB, uh, Mystery Tackle Box Elite Unboxings. I have just started doing some of the uh, uh, RTB, the Rush Tackle Box unboxings. Um, but I also do the Angler's Hall, which is not baits, it's more of, uh, you know, tools. So, I figured, in um, November, we had that kind of odd uh, Angler's Hall reveal, where I get the second, the highest tier, which is um, the Advanced Box. There's two tiers to Angler's Hall, Pro and Advanced. The Advanced Box comes in a large box and basically gives you $160 worth of value. The Pro Box comes in a slightly smaller box, and that gives you around $65 in value. Um, but in November, we didn't get what we normally get. Typically what happens is, an advanced, as an advanced subscriber, you get everything that's in a Pro, and then they add on additional items to bring that value up so that your advanced package gets that $160 overall value for your purchase. In November, however, um, we got one item, which was a rod, that the entire value of the rod was $165. So we never even got to see, as advanced members, what was in the Pro Box. But, I ordered a Pro Box. So I got in contact with uh, Angler's Hall, and very graciously they allowed me to pick up uh, the November's Pro Edition. So even though in my November uh, uh, video, which I will leave a, a little link to at the end of this, uh, so you can go back and see. Um, we didn't get the Pro, uh, the Pro Tools or the Pro Products. Uh, we only got what was the Advanced Package, which would have been just an add-on, but because the add-on itself was, was the entire value of an Advanced Order System, uh, they just omitted the Pro, Pro stuff. So I picked up a Pro on the side. Or should I say, I picked up two pros. So for November, a throwback rewind giveaway, I picked up the pro November box. So we're going to reveal what was in November's Angler's Hall. And I got something at the end of this, which you're going to have to stay tuned for. This isn't going to be a long video. It's not going to be a short video, but it's not going to be a long video. So Angler's Hall's November 2019... Pro Edition box. So, in the Pro box, as I say, typically you'll get a card, it'll have your Pro product list, and then at the bottom you'll have an Advanced product list, which will buffer the value up to that $160 overall. So, uh, this November past Pro box, first item was a Missile Baits Ike, Mike Iaconelli, Flip Out Jig. So here's Mike Iconelli Ike's flip out jig. Uh, this is a half ounce. It's in the super bug color. It's a half ounce flipping jig, so it's probably going to be that. Um, it's not quite a keel jig, not quite a football. It's kind of I call them I call them egg jigs, eggheads, um, because it's kind of like an egghead sinker, but it's uh, as you can see here. Let's get this trailing material out of the way. So there's that egghead style sinker shape. It's somewhat keeled, you know, it's a flipping jig, so it's good for flipping into pads and, and uh, grass and stuff. 
Um, it's got that nicely set eye, and the eye runs perpendicular to the face. It's not parallel to the face, so it runs adjacent to give you that nice tie, so when you're popping in, you're pulling this way, it's not going to rock back and forth. It's going to give you a lot more uh, tension um, and strength when you're pulling it back through, flipping into heavy cover. Nice, very good stout hook. I don't know if he lists what aught this is. Um, so you've got a 5 aught flipping hook. It's got what they call their stealth trailer keeper, which is the old-fashioned, um, you know, it's, it's not, it's just a bell, a bell on the, on the lead shank, so it's just, you know, I particularly like a wire keeper, especially flipping, because I, I tend to yank the, um, the, the soft plastics off, um, you know, when they get caught up in grass and muck and stuff like that. Uh, perfect angle weed guard, da da da, uh, a recessed line tie, which is always good, keeps the, uh, keeps your knot safe from getting, from getting cut up and, and, and abrased, uh, weight forward design, and balanced head for no rolls. Again, like I said, the, the design where they have the eye of the hook running adjacent and also the fact that it's recessed and balances the weight forward, that's gonna A, protect the knot that you tie so it's not gonna get uh, you know, as badly nicked up and, uh, and, and abrased on, on rocks and what have you. And, uh, and it also puts it so, uh, so it doesn't roll side to side. It's gonna nicely pogo through and swim, swim whatever your trailer is going to be pretty darn nicely. So that's good. My, the Missile Baits Mike Iconelli, again, you're paying for a Mike Iconelli product, so you're paying for the name. That's uh, listed here as $5.99. Put that down there. Next up, Lucas Oils. So automotive, meet fishermen. Lucas Oils Marine Real Oil. So we got a little jar here. Uh, it is a one fluid ounce made in the USA, um, little blue colored Lucas oil, real oil, with that really nice needle tip. So, uh, you know, you can get into those small areas of your of your reel and really oil without overdoing it, because you don't want to put too much real oil in. So that's definitely a plus. So the Lucas real oil, marine real oil, is $9.99. Next in the pro for November past, Live Target's Erratic Shiner. Erratic Shiner. Oh, now this is interesting. All right, so here's a live target bait, uh, two and a half inches long. The color is called um, silver bronze. It is a sinking variable sink speed, half ounce weight, and I'm starting to become a pro at pulling out live target baits because they they tend to make these things really hard to freaking unpackage. And I say that, and then the thing is like glued in. So this is basically a, a like a spoon. It's crossed between a. Sp it's just you know a nice little jigging spoon bait. So got this nice. It's got this wave pattern to it. Nice cup. Again, this. Uh, down here. This was half an ounce. Half ounce. Yep. Erratic shiner. That's uh, that's going to be interesting. This would even be good, you know, for, for people fishing, uh, ice fishing right now, vertical jigging this, because it's going to flutter, flutter down, and you rip it up and flutter down. So that's a really cool thing. And it's got that nice in, inlaid shiner, really realistic shiner pattern. The eyes, and then the plastic, the hard plastic on the outside gives you that spoon flutter. But these are definitely, it's going to roll and probably do a nice dying bait fish imitation there. Single treble, very sticky. I will say this, there are some people, uh, I'm not one of them, but there are some people that'll swap out this circular, uh, I, um, excuse me, circular split ring, run into the oval split rings, which I actually do like, and then off of that they'll run a little stinger treble. Um, they'll put a slightly smaller treble than the main one off that, eye, off that uh, split ring, and that allows uh, as this is fluttering down, any fish that's going to slurp it head first, it'll catch them on that. Because sometimes you'll have them grab at the at the line tie and spit. So sometimes that's a little beneficial to put a little stinger hook on the front end of your spoons. Um, it depends, you know, it depends on what kind of waters you're working, uh, deep water, etc. Uh, but some people do test that uh, that helps out with their hookup ratio every once in a while. I'm really interested to throw that. 
uh, once I get on the boat. So the, the Erratic Shiner, that's another $9.99 product. Uh, next down, Live Target again. So we have two Live Target products. This one is a Live Target Square Bill Bait Ball. So we got another Live Target Bait Ball. That's pretty cool. Um, let's see, we got, uh, this is Threadfin Shad, again, and we are at uh, 2 and 3 eighths uh, inches. It's a half ounce again, and the dive depth on this one is 3 to 4 feet, which is awesome for me. I like that. Uh, pearl blue chartreuse is the color, and you can definitely make that out. You got that little hint of chartreuse. And then the pearlescent blue on the top. So you got that going right there. A little dive, Bill. Again, three, three foot or so. That's really kind of cool. Right in my, right in my wheelhouse. Three to four feet. So I'll be interested to throw that, crank that around. I don't mind these bait balls. I really don't. I kind of like them. I mean, I understand the 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 potential they have for showing up. Especially if you can throw these out, if you see, if you mark on your on your electronics, you see um, a bunch of bait fish schooling, a nice bait ball pod. You can throw this into the middle of them and just rip it through, and hopefully, uh, you know, slow slow down with the bait ball, let the bait ball kind of, and you'll be the little tag along, and uh, hopefully that bass will come up behind and swoop this in the midst of uh, of his action. Next and last for the pro tier for that month is Boomerang's multi-purpose tool. Line cutters. All right, so you've got uh, four tools in one. You have a 36 inch nylon cord with a single you know, pin like the old fashioned button pins. Um, so you can pull that out on a zip. And it's a two ounce retraction force. So certainly a lot less than this. What is awesome about this what is absolutely awesome about this, and this is something that I had wanted to buy, but had never gotten around to buying. This is a $20 item. It may or may not, depending on your skill level, be worth every penny. But what you have is you've got your line cutters. And you've got a file for filing up, your fixing your hooks. And you've got a little line eye cleaner, a peg right there. But what interested me more than anything, and something that I had intended to buy and never really did, you also have this loop that you can use to put your hook in to tighten down your knots, and you've got the knot tying tool. You put your hook in there, eyelet comes through, you can tie off, you can wrap your line around for snell knots, etc., and then Pull it off, make your, knot, your nice little tight knot, hook the hook through here, and give it that tug to give you the leverage to make sure your tight is, your knot's secure, it's not going to slip. That is something I have so wanted. Night, uh, knot tying tool, double sided file, eye hook cleaner, and nippers. And obviously, that ringlet also helps with tying the knots and securing it and making sure they're cinched down properly. So, this right here, $20, yes, it's an overpriced piece of aluminum, you know, tin uh, stamped out and what have you. Uh, but it is something that's worth every penny uh, because it's going to help you with tying tighter, more substantially secure, and safer uh, knots. With that said, $20.99, $5.99 for the Missile Baits Iconelli Jig, $9.99 for Lucas Oil Marine Real Oil, uh, $9.99 for the first live target shiner, that, uh, that erratic shiner spoon. You've got $13.99 for that square bill. Sorry, I don't believe I uh, remember. $13.99 for the live target bait ball square bill. And the boomerang uh, multi-purpose with the little um, zip care. I'm not going to use that. I'm just going to use the tool. But uh, $29.99. And like I said, I got two. Exactly identical. So, somebody is going to win this right here. It's going to have all the same tools. You get a $60.95 value. Um, my little, I guess, uh, Valentine's, see my heart's back here, Valentine's Day gift to all the fish lovers out there, um, my hookaholics. To win this, all you've got to do is 
One thing. One thing. I'll get to that in five seconds. Because there's another Angler's Hall box that I have. And that Angler's Hall box is here. And this, you can see, is an advanced box. So, after hearing one of the good YouTubers out there, I don't know if you're aware, but there's a great YouTuber called Bee Fishing Outdoors, Brett and Chris. They do some awesome videos. They created a, their own little pond where they've put in their own structure. Um, bro, uh, Brett actually makes his own soft plastics. Um, he's getting into the pourings of plastics you know, using molds. He doesn't... It's not like um, Marlon Bates where he'll actually make his own mold and then inject uh, hand pour. This guy does the injection pours with the, uh, you know, with the metal molds. But he just made it into Mystery Tackle Box's um, uh, Catch Co. Catch -co uh, as a, uh, you know, as one of their sponsored uh, YouTubers. So my congratulatory sort of box to him is... I'm going to send this Angler's Hall Advance box over to his channel. Hopefully, I'm going to put a little letter inside for him. Hopefully, he'll do a little video review, and uh, maybe it'll, it'll inspire him. But uh, nevertheless, if you want to win this Angler's Hall, what I want you to do is drop a comment down below, like this video, and I'm going to leave Brett and Chris's channel, Be Fishing, I'm going to leave the link to their channel in the description of this channel. I want you to go over to their videos. I want you to watch a couple of their videos or, or whatever. But I want you to comment uh, that Foul Mouth Fishing sent you to them and hashtag Hookaholics. So go over there, drop a hashtag Hookaholics, all capital letters, and, uh, and if I find that hashtag, because it'll come up, I'll, I'll know where you put it. And I'll check it out. When it's on those videos, subscribe to his channel, get help him out, like his videos, watch some of his stuff, help help another brother out. And you, if you have that hashtag and I see your, your channel name in there, you'll be entered to win the Angler's Hall box. So that's all you've got to do. Go over to one of his channel videos, watch one of his videos or two of them. You might find some inspiration. He's got a great, great sense. He knows everything about uh, about baits. I mean, he's an, he's an avid angler. And he's got some great tricks and tips. And like I said, some of his videos on his pond that he's producing is awesome. He's very conservationalist. He's uh, actually tracking the size of the, of the bass because he wants to make a, a bass fishery of just tanks, just monsters. So I wish him all the luck in that. So go over to one of his videos, hashtag hookaholics, and tell him that foul mouth fish and sent you. All right? You do that, and you could be one of the winners of this box. Uh, I'll announce the winner of this Angler's Hall Pro Box. Um, I'll do that in 30 days. So I'll do it at the end of the month. The, uh, the uh, 29th of this month. We'll do it that way. So the 29th of, uh, of February, we'll pick the winner for the Angler's Hall uh, Pro Box. All right? And hopefully by that time, because I'll be mailing this out tomorrow, uh, Brett will get this box and he can do what he wants to do with it. Uh, this is special. Um, I hope he likes it. We'll see. But the guys at Angler's Hall were very gracious, and I want to uh, definitely give my appreciation to them for working around the constraints, putting together the past box so that I could have two of them identical. All the colors are the same. They're exactly identical. And uh, and hooking me up with an advanced box to give to, uh, to Brett. Uh, you know, that's not something every company will do. So, uh... Again, I'm not sponsored by Angler's Hall. I pay full price for everything. But the fact that they went out of their way to actually organize so that I could pick, pick one up was, was pretty cool. They could have said, no, we don't have those anymore. We're not going to rebuild one for you. You're on your own. But uh, as always, thank you for spending some time with me. Uh, hopefully we'll get some video of baits coming right out of boxes, right into the tank so we can see the action. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, again, this is Foul Mouth Fishing to all you hookaholics out there. Tight lines, I'll catch you on the next cast. Peace.